Hey everybody, how's everyone? Today I actually wasn't going to do any filming. I wasn't going to, well, I was maybe going to do some art filming, but I wasn't going to do like a vlog or anything like that. Um, because I just thought, you know, I feel kind of gross. I look kind of gross. Uh, the house is messy. It's just going to be chores and boring stuff. But today turned out to be a little bit different than I thought it was going to be. Um, today for the Galveston Art League, uh, for the gallery, I today is actually changeover day. I thought it was going to be next Monday. Turns out it's today. I'm currently listening to a Master Naturalist Advanced Training for Raptors. So I'm going to have to leave these on for a while. But um, I didn't didn't know today was going to end up like that. So I'm going to go ahead and start filming from now. And then we'll film tomorrow for another day in the life video. And just make this a combined video. Um, and I hope you enjoy. This morning did start out with me making an intro for a previous video that I had done. And I got that done pretty quickly. Next up is the advanced training on raptors, just any birds of prey, like I told you about earlier. It was a really, really good presentation. It taught about how to recognize different raptors while you're out, and I really needed that. Now it's time to get dressed. Done. Now we're gonna leave to go pick up Mama, and then we're gonna go to the gallery on the island. We shared some fries and picked up mom safely and now we're headed to the island to go to our gallery changeover. The water was beautiful today and we saw tons of birds. We got finished with our gallery changeover and then we started to go over to a marina. The marina is in the bay and it's really full of mostly just shrimping boats and there's some really cool little um, fish places to go buy like literally fresh off the boat. Fish and shellfish, it, it's really cool. It's almost like a movie, at least to me. Um, I think it's really beautiful. We parked the car and decided to walk around the marina a bit. There's some restaurants and some walking places. There's even a museum down there. And there's also an old sailing ship called the Alyssa down there. It's really beautiful and it's like a really nice nautical museum type area. We found this old boardwalk kind of behind and underneath this restaurant and we saw tons and tons of pelicans and other birds so we know we had to go in there and check it out. I love pelicans. They're so cute. They're so funny looking and they always just look so sweet. Uh, we transported an injured, an injured pelican with our bird rehab transport team and they, they're funny. Pelicans are some of my fa our family's favorite birds. They're just so cute. I know not everyone is going to get this, but when me and Brinley saw this bird, we got so excited. This is a black crowned night heron, and we don't see these too often. They are fairly common in our area, but you only see them literally right on the water. So if you're on the Kima boardwalk, if you're under a bridge like this, if you're right on the water, you see them. So we don't see them too often. We're like four minutes from the coast, but they just, they live literally on the water. So we don't get to see them too often, but it was really cool to see. They're more secluded and stick to themselves, and they just don't like people quite as much as the yellow crowned night herons, which we see pretty much every single day throughout the spring and summer. This little dingy little robot thing uh, looks so picturesque, so we had to stop and admire it just for a minute. Then we heard something, so we froze because we weren't honestly that sure if we were supposed to be on that boardwalk. We think it was public, but to be honest, we weren't completely sure. So we just kind of waited it out a minute. This pelican did come say hi though.
we just couldn't resist it so we hopped in this little rowboat and we just stood on it we didn't think it was quite that teeter-tottery because it's not quite flat bottomed so it did move around a lot and we were afraid of breaking anything or messing anything up so we were trying to be careful so we were a little bit clumsy We heard more noises, so we ran. All right, we made it out safe. This is the area I was telling you about earlier, where the Alyssa is. I think it's about time to head home now. It was a really beautiful sunset on the way home over the bridge. We stopped at the iconic Bucky's on the way home. The best one, it's in Texas City, because um, some certain snacks can only be found at Bucky's. I actually really like a lot of the art that's in this Bucky's. Most of it is nautical or tropical. So now I'm just looking through some of my stuff seeing what I want to pack, what I want to take. I also am unsure of exactly how much stuff I need to um, take and pack because I'm actually not sure how long we're going to be gone this time. Um, I guess it could be for like a week or it could be two or three, to be honest. Um, you know, it's really up to baby at this point. So we'll see. I think we're actually going to have to upgrade from the backpack to a suitcase this time. Never take a suitcase anywhere, always with a backpack, and I think this time we're going to have to do a suitcase because this is starting to be quite a bit of stuff. Mm-mm. Brinley likes making desserts, and sometimes she gets this wild hair. So today she made these, I don't know, I guess they're like sugar-type covered apples. She like made like sugar syrup and then like dipped the apple slices in there. And they were really good. It was like a crunchy candy shell. They were pretty good. Now I have to deal with this giant mess of leftovers and snacks. It's a whole mess. But it's not all the mess. It won't be a mess forever. Brinley made all of the rest of the candy coating syrup into a hard candy brittle Whoa. type stuff. I'm scared. <laughs> Let's go, you lazy bum! What? Yeah. yeah. My proof. To yeah, there's proof that you're a lazy bum. You be showing my Oh my gosh. Brinley decided she was done being lazy, so we grabbed Granny and took her to run some errands. Are you happy you all got your drinks? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you got me, thank you. We've been having trouble with our speakers and the balance of them in Granny's car recently, so while we were waiting on our groceries, we decided to try and fix them. 
It was really, really hard, and Brinley had already been trying to do it in the days past, so she was already pretty frustrated with it. It was actually pretty confusing because the car manual didn't say anything about this at all. I was genuinely so proud of myself when I figured it out. You cannot believe we have spent days trying to fix this. I was just so happy. Oh, Got home and made dinner and Brinley finished up this dessert. She made a, it's like a custard and then she took that dessert candy, that hard candy that she made and uh, put that on top and kind of crushed it up. It was delicious. It was so good. It was like a lemon curd. I don't know, she's the dessert person, I cook the other food, but it was even better than I thought it was going to be. We then sat down and watched some YouTube together. It's bedtime now, but Luna doesn't think so. <laughs> You're a scary cat. <laughs> Luna! Beans. Oh, scary beans. Ah! Hey everyone, so now it's nighttime. I'm gonna go to bed pretty soon here. Um, but I know today we didn't do any art, but like I said, like we're getting ready to get out of town. We're getting busy. It's kind of insane around here right now with all the stuff that's going on. So I know there was no art in today's video. It really sucks. Every time I try to do like a vlog video, it's like the day that I don't get to do art. And that kind of sucks, but I also get to take you guys on adventures. So that's nice too, but... Um, there should be more art in the next video. Like, today is literally, like, just insane. I have to tell you people. I've literally already taken off my pants. Just want to go to bed. It's kind of insane. I still have to pack. We're leaving in, like, two days. I have to pack everything. Um, I have to get the house ready to leave. The animals ready to leave. Megs, can you stop? Anyways... Um, just, you know, it's crazy around here. Um, more videos will come soon. I hope you enjoyed this one. I hope today was not very boring for you guys. And come spend some more days with me. Don't forget to subscribe, comment down below. Tell me what you liked, tell me what you didn't like. Tell me what you want to see in the future. And uh, don't forget to subscribe. I'm going to be doing a highlighter challenge, just like my, kind of like my crayon challenge that I did a couple weeks ago. And more art videos, more vlog content. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.